Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Let's Read. Today we're going to be diving back into you know, one of our first webcomics we've ever read for the series in Blaster Nation. And to start us off, we have with us a few people. We have our audio engineer, Bry Guy. Heyo! Our good old Sasquatch. Greetings! How you guys doing? And our ever-present Stanton High. Hi, everybody! Are you excited like I am? Because I'm excited. Disclaimer, I, I, <laughs> I have had coffee today. It's so good. But also, bringing in our very special guest with us, hasn't been with us for a while, my good old friend Fighter, a.k.a. Sour Cheese. I'm the token black guy. Yeah. <laughs> you're, you're not the man we get to do all the black people. That would be David, <laughs> because it's funny. We're, we are culturally sensitive here, all right? We didn't just bring in Sour Cheese to come voice in because cause this is the Derek chapter, and he is the main black character in Blaster Nation. We did it because Derek is a fucking black nerd, and Sour Cheese is the nerdiest black guy I know. Perfect. Am I the only black guy you know? Oh, that is besides the point. <laughs> I'm not racist. I just see white people and wrong people. <laughs> <laughs> In any case, um, just to kind of bring everyone up to speed. Well, actually, there's not much to bring up to speed for this. Blaster Nation is just one of those uh, kind of not formless sort of web comics. There is a not so much a solid plot just things happen and today we are, will be going up against some of the the more main side characters i'll be playing the role of high and stanton you can be the father he is our father okay yes what if i got one of those lucky cats are they actually lucky derek if they were really lucky do you think we'd still have so many of them Unless you're planning on opening up a noodle shop in your room, you don't want a lucky cat. Well, there's got to be something I can decorate my room with. Oh man, I could hang one of these katanas on my wall. That'd be pretty badass. Dude, you're like 22 now. Owning fake samurai swords doesn't make anyone cool anymore. I don't need a sword to make me look cool, dumbass. It's an accessory to my current coolness. Whatever, ghost dog. Just don't stab yourself while you pose with it in front of the mirror. What? <laughs> Quit harassing the customer! It's not a customer, Dad. He's my bro. Harassing him is my job. Not when he's in my store. Then he is a customer. And your job is to sell things to our customers. Has your friend seen one of our many authentic Native American dream catchers? They catch dreams. Big seller. In fact, practically everything is Native American is big seller. So I order many item. Feel free to look at our display. I order many item. Yeah, you get you get you buy long time. Oh, God, the Indian display. This must have been what General Custis saw before he died. It's a nice display, Mr. Wu, uh, but I'm going to have to decline. I don't know if I'm ready to turn my room into some kind of Indian reservation just yet. Sure you are, Derek. Maybe after all this, we could go to Home Depot and paint your room in all the colors of the wind. Enough! I am sick of you mocking my products. If you knew anything at all, you would see that these are fine items of pure cultural heritage. Yeah, you're totally right, Dad. You got a real rainbow coalition of tacky Chinese knockoffs here. Really impressive. You would know quite a lot about tacky Chinese things with all these terrible highlights in your hair. <laughs> oh, you wish this junk was anywhere near the quality of my hair. Is that a challenge I hear from your big mouth? How about we match the quality of the sword against that ugly hair, hmm? Ooh, not the fake katana. He'll bring great shame upon us all. <laughs> Let's go, Derek. That's right, go! Both of you, get out of my sight! Wait, what? What about me? I'm supposed to be the customer, remember? 
Damn it, hi! What the hell was that about? Can you stop being a dick long enough for me to buy something? Trust me, bro. You don't want any of that shit. I did you a favor. You can buy me dinner to make up for it. Yeah, you're real charming, asshole. Anywhere else in town you want to go, or are you just going to pick up fights with all the store clerks? Okay, first of all, that was just my dad. We fight like that all the time. Second, I was just trying to save you from a lifetime of buyer's remorse. If you want the best in decorations, all you have to do is ask. I can show you all the sites I get my stuff from. Hi, I've seen your room and the sites you go to, and they are both equally terrifying and sad. I just want to make my room look relatively normal for once. Remember when we almost ran over Dan? The only thing he talked about was how good we are at video games. What, is that bad? We're like fucking legends to guys like Dan. Only guys like Dan. To the rest of the world, we're just guys who base their lives around video games. It's literally the only thing I have going for me. Oh. This is so, so sad. So why exactly is this a problem? Because I'm not getting this at all. I... All my friends are gamers. All I watch is game tournaments. My room is filled with nothing but gaming shit. I just want something that makes me, I don't know, normal. Well, buying my dad's shit won't help that. People will just think you're into games and have shitty taste in decorating. What's with this obsession with normalcy anyways? Hell, I play way more games than you and I'm still... Oh ho, still got the hots from Melissa, do ya? You never told me you were still after her. Is that what all this stuff is about, you big sap? Nothing like that, man. It's just... She's one of the few girls around here that actually plays games, you know? But there's plenty of dudes like me after her and she rejects them all. So maybe if I could show her I was more than just another gamer. Maybe. Hi? What the hell are you doing? I swear, if you open that door and yell something obnoxious. Boy, I sure do love me some video games. Oh, hey there, hi. Hey, Derek. I haven't seen you two here in, like, forever. Oh, did you miss us, Mal? Truth be told, I'm here on business. Need to find a game for Derek here, you see? Oh, what game is it? I can look it up for you guys and see if we have it in stock. Nah, you don't have to do that. I'll go find it. Derek, you stay here and make sure no one cuts us in line, okay? I hate you so much for this, I. Ask if they have battle toads. They love that shit. So how you been, Derek? Done anything interesting with your life? No, uh, just more of the usual, I guess. Oh, is that your cell phone? It looks nice. Oh, thanks. Honestly, I use it more like an MP3 player than an actual phone. Nobody calls me on this thing, so I just filled it full of groups I like. Medeon, Passion Pit, stuff like that. Got any favorite artists? I might have something you like on here. The Music I Like by Derek, age 22. Street Fighter 3, Third Strike. Blaze Blue, uh, Continuum Shift, OS OST. Uh, God, the God of War tracks, God Hand soundtracks, goddamn Katamari Damacy game know. soundtrack. Tekken has good music sometimes. I don't know. No More Heroes, Sonic Adventure, Amazing Bando, Megaran. <laughs> ah! I don't know. Kanye West. Ew, Kanye. Sorry, dude. Didn't put any of that on here. Did, did I say Kanye? I meant. Uh... Found it. <laughs> Here you go. No thanks are necessary, but if you got any, I'll take them. Come on, hi. You know I didn't come to town to buy a video game. Wait, is that Space Hopper? Uh, yes. Oh my god, that's like my favorite game ever. Have you played it? No, never heard of it. Is it really that good? It, it really is. You play as this cute alien rabbit girl, and you hop around space and fight pirates and stuff. Huh. Guess that explains the cover. Seriously, it's amazing! See all these planets? These are all levels you can hop through. That sounds cool. Do you do anything else in it? Try those baby tears, scrub! Don't be getting salty just cause you ain't got my mind level! Was that yeah, supposed to be your black people voice? 
Well, I was going for whatever growth is. I don't know who's speaking. <laughs> I don't was, know if it is Dreadlocks guy or the fat white dude. That was, that it was, could be either of them. That was pretty bad. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not trying. We're not trying here. I'm not a scrub. You're the scrub. All you do is spam that same attack all match. Yo, it's not my problem if you can't adapt my strategy. That what I think it is? Yep. It's those tourney guys again. They've been at it all damn day. Tourney guys? Do you hold tournaments here? We started a fighter tournament last month. They won and bought a year-long membership card so they can keep playing there. <clears throat> those ass clowns has shown up every other day just to yell at each other and play that stupid fighting game. They're obsessive and totally fucking obnoxious. The worst part is, they keep scaring away everyone else. Oh, they're nice about it. They'll play with them. But then they fucking what? destroy them at their stupid game until the new guys get fed up and walk out. If they're that bad, why don't you just kick them out? Because they're not technically doing anything wrong. And my boss doesn't want to enforce a time limit. The boss thinks a time limit would give people less reason to come here and play. But now I just wish they had a reason to leave. I don't know. I just wish somebody would take them down a notch, you know? I know exactly what you mean. Well, would you excuse us for one second? Dude, this is absolutely perfect. You can be your hero. Not sure if I'm following you here. Come on, all you have to do is kick their asses and make them leave. You've done tournaments before. You know what these people are like. I guess. I haven't really done the fighting scene in a while, though. I don't know who these guys are, even what they're playing. Psh, please. This is Sucre Marin. They're probably playing Smash Bros or something over there. Or some other shitty fighter. Or just think, man, if you clear this place out, it'll just be you and her. I'll even leave you two alone. Hey, Melissa. Hmm? I'll Where's... take care of these guys for you. Bam, down, boom. Seriously? You're gonna take care of these guys? Well, I mean, uh, maybe I could convince them to just leave or something? Uh-huh. And how are you going to go about proposing this course of action to them? I don't know. I was thinking I could go see what they're playing and try talking to them. Is it cool if I go in? Well, I guess it's okay. Don't stay in there too long, though. My boss will kill me if he finds out I let non-members in. Relax. Derek can kick their asses in no time. Well, hell yeah. Go get him. You up for this? Guess we'll find out. Hello? Mm. Here, let me hit the light for you guys. Ah, yeah. oh, fuck, you made me drop my combo. Yeah. Pause. Yeah. Pause the damn game so my eyes can adjust. I told you guys to leave the lights on. Oh, damn. Is that some trial by fighter? I haven't played that in forever. Yo. Can you hold on for your nostalgia for a minute? Don't want you breaking my concentration. Dude, this is going to be a more perfect game for you to stomp them at. Look, there's another one. Do you think she's with them? How the hell would I know, dude? Oh, hey there. Are you two new members? Uh, no questions. Don't ask them. There's no answer. It's been way too long since we've had any new faces come here. What's your names? I'm Hi, the attractive one. This is my friend Derek, who was hoping to kick ass at some friendly fighting games. Well, you come to the right place. I'm Jenny. You can probably see I'm a little more unique than the other guys. I'm actually more of a competitive Pokemon player than a fighter. The rotunda, the rotund one is Juwan. We call him Tortoise. You know I never agreed to such a nickname. Well, maybe you ought to stop turtling like a little bitch. Boom! 
That's ten in a row, baby. Mm. Can you yeah. even counterpick? Pack your stick up and go back to tutorial mode, bitch. They keep dropping combos like they were bars out on soap in prison. You might as well be. That's Curtis Morton, aka Salty Kurt. Doesn't look too salty to me. That's our current trial by fighter champion. He's been undefeated since we left the old store. The old store? Yeah, we only recently started coming here. Before the warp zone, we were the kings and queen of a place called Game On, with Kurt as our top player. That was until he showed up. Now, I'm not one to gossip, but one day, this new guy came in and just decimated poor little Kurt. Kurt demanded several rematches, but he just couldn't beat him. The crowd could only laugh at his futility and saltiness, hence the nickname. Eventually, Kurt's sodium levels went critical, and he was banned from the store. We found this place, and he's been racking up wins and partying it up ever since. No one's been able to beat Kurt here? Nope. Poor Kurt would have probably have to run away from here, too, if he got bodied like that again. In that case... Hey, Kurt, hmm. I challenge you to trial by fighter. Dun, dun, dun. Whoa, yeah. fuck. Who do you think you are dramatically calling me out and shit? Oh, hey, I didn't mean to offend or anything. I just want to play some trial by fighter with you. You want to play against me? Do you even know how big of a deal I am? You're challenging one of Suka Marin's best players. Son, I got over a thousand trophy points on Shoryuken's forums. Who the fuck do you think you are? Look, let's both cut the theatrics, all right? I just want to play some damn video games. I right, cool. Get the fuck out of here, Tort. About the time someone else lost to me. Is this guy seriously wearing an Animal Crossing t-shirt? All right, plug your fight stick in so we can do this shit. Hold on. I didn't bring a stick with me. You have an extra one I can use? An extra? Ha! Have you seen this thing? This bitch is packed Sanwa parts, a circle gate joystick. It's compatible with all three platforms. It's loaded with all kinds of blue LED lights. Why would I ever need an extra stick? God, that thing is beautiful. I've never seen anything glow so blue before. Well, since you're challenging Kurt, I guess I can let you use my godlike stick to fight him. Oh, sweet, thanks. Swag as fuck, right? I had to commission an artist online to do the art. Totally worth the $400 I spent on it. Yeah. It's nice. Real. Real <laughs> well, nice. Tasteful. I'm, I'm glad you like it. Here. I love oh. it. I wish I had one of my own. Don't, don't mind the sticky bits in the... And I'll play around it. <laughs> <laughs> God damn, son. Can you move any slower? Hurry up and pick a fucking character already. How the hell are you rushing me when you haven't even picked your own character yet? You serious? It's a little thing called counterpicking. Go on and pick your best. I'll just wait. Whatever. It's been way too long since I've played this, but I still remember most of this guy's moveset. Who, Adrian? That guy's pretty low tier. Why you want to pick him? Because you look like him? No! Fuck you and fuck everyone else who says that! He just matches my playstyle, alright? I look nothing like him. I've got hair. Yo, all right, man. Chill. Just start the game. Fair warning, man. I ain't holding back. Trust me. It won't matter. Burn down, down. Now loading. The challenger, Adrian. Take a long, hard look at me. Now, dog. Because when this is over, the only thing you see is my nuts teabagging your face. Come on, man. Seriously. You're really gonna play a Momo against me? What, you scared? You afraid to fight against god tier beast that is Momo? Quit being a bitch and fight me! For fuck's sake, just let me do a damn button check first. Christ! Okay, we got a square gate joystick. Not my preference, but I can work with this. Punch buttons are all mapped to default. Good, good. Fierce kick. Sticks a bit, but shouldn't <laughs> be any problem. Alright, now for special moves. Shit. What was that parry input again? Break time's over, bitch! Oh shit! First attack, 2,000 points. Dude, what the fuck? Don't start the match by spamming fucking fireballs. It ain't spam, it's strategy. Either work around it or feel the heartburn. 
There's no strategy here, jackass. You're just repeating the same attack over and over. That's what I was saying. You're better than this, Derek. Jump out and use an overhead attack. Right. Dive kick always works. Heh. Gotcha, bitch. Ah! <laughs> Say it like Dave Bell. Ooh. Thump. Hmm. Here I was thinking I'd be fighting a real competitor. But it looks like you can only win by spamming. Think again, bitch. Tump, 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 tump. Oh! Two hits, three hits, four hits, nine hits, ten hits. Momo Cannon! Thirty hits, knockout. Damn, dog, were you even trying to fight back? Were you trying to fight back? You didn't have to go and give me a perfect victory, man. Even Torts not that generous. This really hurts my voice. Come on, Derek. Quick, find like an amateur. This is shit you should be able to avoid. He's putting you right where he wants you, but you just bend right over and yelling, Oh, yes, sir. Please zone me to death. I'd love to help you build your super meter. I know, I know, I know dude. It's been years since I've played this game. There's so much I've forgotten. Stop remembering the way you're playing now. I think you were just some geek off the street, not the full. Yo, scrub! If you're not too busy talking to your husband, I was hoping I could kick your ass again. Oh, come on. If anyone's going to call me gay, it isn't going to be the guy playing a little girl shooting hot fireballs. Bitch, if you don't like my fireballs, quit eating them. He's got a point, honey. Get in close. Don't even give him the chance to spam those things. You ready for round two? Fight! Oh. Mind games, bitch! Rah. Shit! Swoosh! Clever scrub. Smack. Ha! What is this, baby's first combo? Hey guys, how's the fight going? Shit just got real. Yeah, Derek got crushed in the first round, but he's making an awesome comeback now. Oh, is he the one beating up the little girl? Woo! Go, Derek! Oh, hey, Melissa! You best be paying attention, you scrum lord. You think you're big? Just because you got a couple hits on me? I'm the best fighter in the city, bitch. You're not going to beat me. No one's going to beat me. And keep taking chip damage like this. If only I could remember the parry come. All right, fuck this. Ayo, what the hell are you doing? I'm checking the command list. Oh, you just can't, pa you just can't pause in the middle of the match? That shit gets you disqualified. Yeah, in a tournament match, which this isn't. Ah, there's the parry command. Back forward punch, but I... Oh, I get it. See, I was doing a forward back punch. No wonder I lost that first round. I kept trying to do it backwards. Man, are we fucking done now? Oh yeah. We're done now. Thwack. Punch. Punch. Kick. Palm. Man. Yeah. Holy diver! <laughs> K.O. Go, Derek! Woo! <laughs> Volcano. <laughs> oh, yes. That was fairly impressive, scum lord. Oh, no. He's acting like a Dragon Ball Z villain again. Kurt! Of course, it'll take more than a few dodges and parries to beat me. Curtis, you need to calm down. You're letting this new guy get into your head. Yeah, come on, dude. I don't want to get kicked out of this place, too. What's wrong, Kurt? You were talking such a big game not too long ago. Sorry, but if you're <laughs> going to act, act like this anytime someone new steps in and kicks your ass then maybe you should stick to beating up your friends and pretend you're good.
Man, this has been the longest fight ever. Fight! Fuck you! Ash, Ash, wake up! Rise and shine, sleepyhead. I'm sending you out to feed. Do I have to? Of course you do. What kind of vampire doesn't get her daily supply of virgin blood, huh? Does it have to be virgin blood? Can I just drink any sort of blood? Seriously? Are you new to this whole vampire thing? We don't do non-virgin blood. It's impure and nasty and can carry all sorts of diseases. All right. Jeez, I'll go find some darn virgin blood. Good. And you better not come back until you've eaten, even if you have to feed off of one of your nerdy little friends. Fine, whatever. I'm leaving. Keep your cell phone on. Ah. And so Ash searches for her prey. Oh, wow. I guess they're off the list. She searches. Really tempting, but let's be honest here. So not a virgin. And searches. These two seem kind of close. Maybe they're... I probably shouldn't risk it. But then... Then there's this guy. Wait, let's see. <gasps> Ash? What, what are you? What are you? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I just wanted to... Wait. These posters. These figurines. You're perfect. What? No. 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 Happy Halloween. Fuck off, you fucking scrub. Woo. You're making him salty as shit, bro. Salty? Salty, 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 salty. No, no, no. No. Not again. You're not going to make a fool out of me. Come on. Hit me. You're just going to dodge all day, huh? I'll dodge this bitch. Curtis, stop. <laughs> Bonk. You win. I quit. Oh. Dude, you broke him. Maybe we should go, Kurt. Come on, bro. Oh, please. What's the big deal here? It's just a stupid game. You think this is just a game? It's not just a game. Not to me. <laughs> Curtis, don't cry. We've talked about this before. Yeah, Kurt. Crying ain't hype. <laughs> Shut up. You don't know how hard it is. I've spent years practicing on this game for what? Just to get wrecked by some walking scrub off the street? F f fuck that. Fighting games? All I know. I spent my life playing them. But I'm as dog. I'm, I'm garbage. Oh, man, Derek, I can't believe you made a guy cry over this shit. I know exactly what he's feeling. How do you do? <laughs> Look, maybe I should have been more upfront, but the truth is, I'm no scrub off the street. I'm Derek Dominique, the 2007 Trial by Fighter FIVO champion. <laughs> no offense, but you are a FIVO champ? Bullshit! I've never seen you on YouTube! Well, shit, guys, I'm no Daigo. But, no, seriously, I used to be just like you, Kurt. I got my ass kicked for years, but I never quit. It took what seemed like forever, but I still won FIVO, Kurt. Yeah, good for you, dog, but that ain't me. I ain't gonna win FIVO. I can't even win a local match anymore. No matter how good you get, you're still gonna lose often. You just can't let it get to you, man. Before anyone can be a winner, 
They've got to learn to be better losers. Yo, that's probably some deep shit you just said. Seriously, though, get your hands off me. You're all right, Derek. I guess you're not a scrub after all. Oh. Come on, let's get out of here. Maybe I could get us unbanned from the old store. Swag! Come see us, <laughs> come see us at our hangout, Derek, Dominique. I'll be ready for a rematch. Looking forward to it, Salty Kurt. See you at Fivo, fucker. It was nice meeting you. Bye. So, you gonna go fight him again? Hell no. That guy almost hit me. <laughs> Aw, but I thought you were just like him. Well, I mean, I was just, you know. Ah, don't worry about it. You're nowhere near as bad as those guys. I just can't believe people like that, you know? I like games too, but that was just crazy. Seriously, I owe you one, dude. Well, uh, actually, I was wondering if, uh, maybe... Yeah? That Space Hopper game. I was wondering if I could buy it? Uh, yeah, sure. Let me find the disc. Um, well, you blew it, Derek. You wasted half of my day for nothing. You high. It just didn't feel right. No, fuck you. She said she owed you one. That was your opportunity. What? I beat a dude in a video game so she should reward me with a date? Hawk, fair maiden, I have vanquished the vile tourney bro. Might I take your hand in courtship? I'd look like an idiot if I tried to ask her out after that shit. Oh, please. You pussied out. Even after I got you her favorite game. Yeah, how'd you even know about that? We used to talk a lot back in school. We were pretty close. Wait, were you two dating? What? No, God, no. Why would I do that? Sup, Dad? Derek's crashing here tonight. Oh, uh, Derek want pizza? Your sister is picking up pizza later. I want to meet lovers, and Derek wants to be a wimp for the rest of his life. Just pepperoni, please. So, what do you want to do now? I don't know. Watch some TV or something, I guess. Sure, maybe after we can talk about girls that we're never going to ask out. Man, are you going to keep this up all night? No, first I'm going to take a shower. Then I'm going to keep it up all night. So enjoy the break. I'll savor every moment. Oh, dun dun dun. And that's the end of that chapter. So, what do you guys think of Blaster Nation? I liked it. It was pretty good. Uh, it's just basically, oh, there's this. They set up, oh, and these two friends. They're gonna try oh, to. Oh, right. Sass wasn't here for the rest of the comic. <laughs> these guys are minor characters, really. <laughs> this is oh. like. A chapter that they have this is oh. not oh <laughs> oh this is wait. just an aside this... wait let me see this is a blast i've i read blast nation a long time ago does it still hold up yeah it's still pretty good it's a nice little slice of life and it's a really interesting i like this story arc it kind of subverts a lot of things derek actually relating to the guy who just almost hit him but it's very gamer. It's that, uh, Stanton, it's been forever since you've, since we've read this comic. How do you Shit. feel about it? Well, I, uh, actually, I really liked all these, the characters in this comic. Um, I, I wish there wasn't, like, a little side plot that was going on, because, uh, I feel like these guys might be more interesting or just as interesting as, as the, uh, original story. Because now I'm now I'm super intrigued, and I want to know how what he thinks of the game. You know, I, I want to know where where this goes. Like, does this game suck? Is this girl like not care about the game anymore and just wants to talk to him? Like, what's going on? Where where does this lead? And uh, I I think the animation style is like iconic. It's so good. It's really consistent, and it just looks. It looks so good, you don't think about it. And I, I think that's a uh, 
that's a, a huge thing because uh, a lot of time you, you'll see stuff and you'll be able to pick it out. But when you walk, go through a comic and, and nothing stands out negatively, it it's really that that's an impressive thing to do. Yeah, especially when it bounces back, like with the art, the different art style that is in the fighting game or there's more of an anime character in there. Oh, yeah, that, that's so, that was some of my, my favorite pages is how, yeah. how they mixed it all up and and didn't really you know, I, I don't know. It's just it, it all flowed really, really nicely. So, yeah, I, I think this is one of the best. Um, I'm always, always down to read Blaster Nation because this is this, this is top tier shit, in my opinion. Yeah. If there's anything that it does really well, it's not just it's intermeshing the styles and also the interpersonal dramas. Oh, for and sure. having them isolated in these chapters is a lot better for pacing. Yeah, for sure. And each character has you know their own set of sub characters that they interact with, and they already established so much of that just in this. One chapter is kind of like impressive, you know. It's like, okay, this is this should be its own comic. To tell you the truth, yeah, it's a whole world. It's the best way of world building through characters. But also, uh, Bry, what do you think of Blaster Nation? Uh, it was kind of a wave. I feel like most of it. <laughs> um, so no opinion. I would say it was okay what? from what I saw. It was funny. I liked the comedy. I to say like it's good and to have like a good thing. Said. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. Yeah, come join us next time where we'll, we'll probably continue on Blaster Nation for another episode. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. It's time to say goodbye, boys, now. Goodbye. Hey, bye. 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 Peace out, baby. Goodbye. Every time I meet another Brian, I instantly like them a little bit more. That that's his internal Brias. <laughs> Boo! Oh, I know. I'm come on, kill you. Come yeah. on. This is why you're not a Bry Stan. <laughs> that was a you good one. I hate you guys. <laughs>